It's me, Stom the Bean, and welcome back to Project Ozone. Uh, we're back for f episode 15, and uh, yeah, I am terribly sorry for not posting any videos for the last week. Uh, it was the school holidays, uh, my children were with me, I spent a lot of time with them, um, and as you guys, I know you'll understand, family comes first, and... Um, yeah, so that's what I was doing, and I, I do apologise for the lack of videos. Um, you may have saw the Bean Boozle Challenge, that's when they were all here and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, I just want to apologise, but guys, if you're still enjoying Project Ozone, then please do hit that like button down below, and also subscribe to my channel for daily Minecraft videos. Let's get on with today. What we're going to do is we're going to try and get some quests completed. Um... I feel like we're doing good on everything that we've got going so far. Um, we've got an awful lot of ingots and things like that. Um, I mean, just look at all that. That's that's amazing. Uh, so let's take some of these and go and put those into our ME system. Because if you remember, last episode we got the ME system. Um, what I want to do is just fire some of these ingots in. Uh, do we have... We do have space. That's all right. Uh... Wow, we've got an awful lot. Uh, if I space bar that, there we go, get rid of that, and uh, just get rid of all that. Uh, what we're going to do today is this quest here, uh, which is called a nullifier. Void all you don't need. I'm assuming it gets rid of stuff. Um, so, a task where the player has to craft specific items. We have to make a nullifier and an augment nullification chamber. Never made one, don't know what it is, don't know what it does, but let's see if we can build one of these things. Uh, so first we need a pneumatic servo, can we make one of those? Yes we can, fire that up in there. Uh, then we need some tin gears, can we make some tin gears? Yes we can, we'll, we'll, we'll make a few of those. Uh, there we go, we'll fire those up in there. Uh, do we have a bucket of lava? We do not have a bucket of lava, but I know where I've got some. Uh, so let's go and grab some of those over here. Um, and guys, uh, also, I've been thinking about maybe, uh, at some point in the future, doing some GTA 5 videos. Uh, with Because there's a lot of mods on GTA 5. Now, I understand GTA 5 is a little bit of a grown-up type game, um, but I really quite fancy doing that um what do you guys think what do you guys think let me know in the comment section down below if you would like to see me play some gta 5 i would quite happily do that um i'd obviously have to get the game and stuff like that um and i'm also uh, hopefully gonna try and get a server set up for you guys to come and join me and come and play right anyway now we've made that let's go into the quest book we've made those and we can claim a reward we'll claim that one on the end there yes we've got a chance cube but we'll look at that later uh we got ink sack Fancy lantern and a printing press. Really? A printing press. Nothing of interest. Not really. Uh, so if we fire that in there, I don't know. Uh, destroys. Just what, what does this do? Removes things from existence. Well, I don't really have any use for that right this very second. Um, but cool, I guess. Let's get some food. Uh, do we have any steak? Um, uh, so there's tea. Uh, uh, um, I, I can't see because I'm looking around my mic. There we go. Right, let's take all those steak. Uh, eat some food because we're we're low on health. Let's have a look and see what other um, achievements we can get done today, or, or whatever you want to call them. Uh, right, so we've done the nullifier. Uh, what's this thing? Metallurgic infuser. Is that right? Metallurgic Confuser is one easy way to obtain steel. This machine will allow you to make enriched alloy and basic control circuits that will be used in many recipes, including making themselves better for more advanced recipes. So, let's see if we can build a Metallurgic Infuser. Is this going to be expensive? Uh, let's have a look. So, let's check this out. Uh, metal. Metal. Allergic confuser. Where are you, sir? Where are you? Um, yes. Okay. <laughs> metal lur. Me metal lur. Met 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 met. How do we spell this? Ugh. I was just playing. I know how you spell all this sort of stuff. Honest. 
Alex, I know you guys believe me, right? Okay, so metallurgic infuser um, should be pretty easy. We should be able to make that. Oh, all right then. Uh, have we got any cobblestone? Hopefully, we've got plenty of cobble. There we go. We've got some cobble. Uh, let's make a couple of fern eye um, furnaces. Sis, 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 sis. There we go. Check those up there. Check that out there. Make that. Make that. Can we do it? Yes, we can. There we go. Metallurgic Infuser. That is another quest completed. And uh, we get Enriched Alloy, Basic Control Circuit, another Chance Cube, and we get to choose a reward bag. That one. Claim reward. There we go. Awesome. What did we get? We got some dirt. All right. Yeah, it was kind of crap. I agree. Um, right. Okay. So let's chuck that up in there. That, 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 that. Um, the Metallurgic Infuser, you can make steel and stuff like that. I get that, but... Um, it was easier to make it with iron bars, right? No? Okay, right, so what else we got? Mechanized. Uh, I, I don't want to make that right now. Um, soul splicing, induction, outduction. Induction smelter resonant, it says. But I bet it doesn't have to be a resonant. Let's make an induction smelter. Okay, so let's look at the recipe for that. Induction smelter... Induction smelter. Where are you? There we go. Uh, that is the recipe for that. So we're looking at Invar, a bucket, and all that business. Right, we can do this. We can do this. I bet we've got it all already. I hope. Right. So we're a bit short on Invar. Invar. Uh, let's make an Invar gear. That's uh, two of those. There we go. Awesome. We are running low on Invar. Um, we need one of these redstone reception coils. There we go. Can we now make this in bar? Oh, no. We need the machine frame. Oh, dear. Right. Okay. Machine frame basic. There we go. Um, we need a tin gear. We'll make one of those. Um, let's just try and get that basic again. Please. Please. Please, sir. Basic. Basic. There we go. And boom. Yes. Um, and then we should be able to just do that. And then we've got a... Oh, it says basic. Are we going to get away with this? Induction smelter basic? Uh, please? Yay! Right, okay. Let's have the one in the middle this time. Okay. And we've got Mars Surface Rock Moon Turf from Crap Rewards. Uh, okay, so induction smelter. I've never used one. I don't think I've used one. Let's go power it up, though. Um, we, we should have some space around here to plug it in somewhere. Here we go. Here we go. We'll, we'll just plop that just there. There we go. What's an induction smelter do? I have absolutely no idea what it does. None whatsoever. I mean, I can't believe all these things are powering everything for us. It's amazing. I need to make some more at some point. I'm going to make a lot more. Um... But right now, I want to do more quests. I want to get more stuff done. I, I really would like to get somewhere. The wither? Don't add a command block to this. What? Kill the wither boss? Um, no. No, I am not. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, mechanized. I don't want to do that one right now. Solid smelting. Magma crucible resonant. Okay, let's make a magma crucible. Um, let's get some of these out of the way. Uh, magma crucible. Yeah, there we go. Uh, so it's going to be Invar gears again, which I don't think I have any Invar. Invar. Uh, we've got two Invar blocks, so let's turn those into normal Invar ingots. There we go. That will allow us to make two invar gears there we go uh so if we click on that what nether brick oh we may have to go and get some nether brick uh we need to make a leadstone energy cell can we make one of those um letting uh, we don't have uh do we have the redstone block let's have a look uh block of redstone yes we do right fire that up there then we'll make the leadstone energy cell. There we go. Fire that up there. Um, we need to make a basic machine frame. There we go. Uh, so that's another tin gear. 
Oh my gosh, this thing is quite expensive. Um, then, uh, basic, please? Please, sir? Please? There we go, basic, and there we go, basic machine frame. Um, and then we need a, a redstone energy cell thing. Um, and then we should be able to make this, right? No, what are we missing? We're missing the nether brick. Okay, so we need to go to the nether. Let's go and find some nether brick in the nether. Hopefully, there's a fortress somewhere close. Please? Now, can you get nether brick by smelting nether rack? Whoa. What is going on? What what is going on? Right, okay, let's let's just look this up a minute. Nether brick. How do we get that? Nether brick, how do we get that? Nether rack, nether rack. Right, so if we just grab some nether rack, we can get nether brick. Alright, awesome. Alright, oh, okay. Vein miner's not activated. I'm not going to do it right now. I don't really need vein miner right now. Um, we'll just grab a load of this. Uh, just to make some nether brick. Uh, so what I'll do is I'll go back. I'll smelt this down. And I'll see you shortly. Okay, so there we go. We've got nine nether brick there. That should be enough for me now uh, to make uh, two of these. There we go. Awesome. And then that means we can get this completed. And that is one more quest complete. There we go. Right. Awesome. Uh, so what was this thing? Uh, a magma crucible. I don't know what a magma crucible is, but let's claim our reward. Uh, we'll, we'll claim that reward bag. We'll, we'll open that shortly. Um, let's go over and plug this in. I don't know what this does. Again, the, uh, see, I'm starting to get into mods that I don't understand. Um, that's my problem. Um, a magma crucible. Does it make... Does it make lava? Maybe? I don't know. I've no idea. Uh, but yeah, I'm getting into mods where I don't quite understand what, what things are for. Um, this is all completely new to me. What did we get? We got an epic bacon. It's a plain reward. Awesome. Um, epic bacon. Nice. I'm just going to shove that straight in the ME system. Uh, we're starting to get full. Uh, so I may have to make another... Um, a machine thingy. ME drive. That's what I'm trying to think of. Um, let's see if we can get one more done. One more quest done. And then we're going to open some chance cubes. Uh, what's this? Fluid forming. Ah, oh, I've done that one already. I made a fluid transposer. Let's claim that reward then. What did we get? Uh, material dimension shard. Mob blitz dimlet. Mob wither dimlet. A material... Uh, block of diamond dimlet. Um, I'm pretty sure they're awesome. It's a chasm reward. Is that, is that the mod mod pack maker guys reward? Uh, let's just see if we can do that last one. Um, infinite. A task where the player has to craft specific, specific, specific item. Uh, these are slightly buggy it says. The tesseract. How expensive are they? Because if they're really expensive, I'm not going to do it right now and I'm going to go and open those chance cubes. T-E-S-S -S, Tesseract. Um, tesseract frame empty. Tesseract frame full. Tesseract. Uh, bronze, silver. Silver, bronze. Tesseract frame full. Um, it's going to require resonant ender, which you get from putting... Ender pearls into a magma crucible. That is... Oh, I can't do that. No. That's going to be too much for me now. But maybe next episode uh, we'll get on with that. What I want to do is put my quest book in here. Um, and I'll leave the pick. And let's take out the chance cubes. And let's go and open these five chance cubes. Let's see what we get. Hopefully. Something nice. Something good. Uh, but now I know what the Magma Crucible is for. It's to, for making Resident Ender. Um, so that's good. That is good. Right, let's, let's head over here where we did our, uh, do all, all of our chance cubes. It is raining, but never mind. Um, let's see what we get. Come on, give me something good, please. 
Uh, we just needed these ender lilies. I can't believe that. That was that that just came up in in the in the what's it? What's that? Is that cobblestone? <gasps> Loads of cobblestone. Right. Let's put that and that in there. I, I mean, it might not survive, but let's put it in there anyway because you never know. What was that? What, what what happened there? What happened? Okay, come on. Uh, experience I'll take. I will take experience all day long. This is the last one. I need to check. Have I got this on um, Peaceful? No, I don't have it on Peaceful. I mean, because normally when I open up these uh, chance cubes, I always think, oh, I'm going to die, I'm going to die, and, and then I forget I got it on Peaceful. Um, and usually I get terrible stuff, but right now I'm getting good stuff. So please be good. Welcome back, Seth Bling here. Alrighty then. Um, I don't know what that was all about, but there we go. Um, we've done all our chance cubes. Unfortunately, guys, we have just about run out of time. Um, I'm, I'm hoping this episode's a, a reasonable, um, reasonable length in time. Um, and just to let you know that I am back from the holidays, uh, back to record, and. Um, yeah, let me know about the GTA thing. I'd really like to know that. It's not something I'm going to be doing like tomorrow or anything like that. But maybe, you know, just uh, one episode a week. Maybe a live stream, something like that. I don't know. Um, but yeah, thanks very much for watching. This has been Project Ozone. I have been Stump the Bean. Good.